it doesn't matter that the point doesn't actually exist. That if we were to try to plug in 7, our function would be undefined. The limit exists because we are approaching this point from either side. That the point ex does not exist doesn't matter. What matters is that we approach that point from either side. Those are limits, and those are looking at the different types of limits. A hole, an actual point that exists, a point of jump, as well as vertical asymptotes, and end behavior. I know it seems like a lot, but if you understand the ideas, then hopefully this makes sense. That has a lot of limits on our screen. All right, if you're curious about holes, the next topic is going to be looking specifically at the side topic of holes. So if you're ready for that, you can go on to the next video. Otherwise, go back, review limits, make sure that makes sense. Both the one-sided limits and looking at what happens at a limit from both sides at once.